Express, full body, two exercises, two rounds, straight into a goblet squat, let's go. So you're sitting back into this imaginary chair, your knees are in line with your toes, chest up, back straight. Good, we've got 20 seconds here. Swapping in five, four, three, two, one, and we're down the ground, side plank and oblique crunch. Make sure your elbow is in line with your shoulder, your knee is in line with your elbow, and you're crunching in your side oblique. Good, good, keep going. We're gonna swap sides. Good. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, and we are swapping sides. Make sure you set yourself up. Crunch in, well done, keep going. From here we're going back into that goblet squat. So we've got two exercises, two rounds. This is express full body. Three, two, one, and back into that goblet squat, making sure your knees are in line with your toes on the way down. This is meant to be hard, it's meant to be fast, you're meant to push yourself. Good. Keep going. Focus, squeeze those glutes on the way up. Three, two, one, and down into that side plank and oblique crunch. Set yourself up. No rest, just straight into it. Stretch all the way out, crunch all the way in. Good. Swapping sides in three, two, one, and swapping sides. Good. Like I said, no rest, express, full body, nice and fast. Get through this and we're moving on to our next two exercises. Three, two, one. We are doing Russian twist and a kneel to jump squat. So get into that Russian twist position and let's move straight into it, go. Side to side. Now, if you wanna make it a little bit harder, you can lift your feet up off the ground. I've got my feet on the ground. Right, so from here we're going to kneel to jump squat. Three, two, one, let's go. In a kneeling position, we're going up, up, jump and back down. So absorb that landing. When you jump up and land back down, you're absorbing that landing. Good. Making sure you're alternating your legs as you come up and you go down. Fantastic work. Going back into that Russian twist. Two exercises, two rounds. Three, two, one, and back down into that Russian twist. Side to side, rotate at your torso. You keep your feet on the ground or you can raise them up if you need. But don't stop moving. Keep going, you got five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And up into that kneel to jump squat. Up, up, jump and back down. Absorb that landing. Keep going. Go, 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 starting to burn. Push it out. Don't stop. This is burning me. Four, three, two, one. And we are moving into our next two exercises. We have a curl and press and a bent over row and reverse fly. So let's go into that curl and press. Come up, press above our head, lower down with control. Does anyone else tap their foot like I tap my foot? I don't know why I do it, but it's just comfortable for me. Let's go. We're gonna hinge at the hip. We're gonna bend and do a bent over row and then a reverse fly. Hinge at our hips and up and fly. Good, row up and fly. Keep that core on. 
Fantastic work. Squeeze those back muscles on the way up. Express workouts, incredible, anytime, anywhere. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, you know what it is, curl and press, back up. Good, back to me doing that little foot tap. I don't know why I do this, but hey, it helps. Push up, lower down, good. Everything is with control. Don't drop those weights. Don't fling your body up. Nine, eight, seven, six. You've got five seconds. Four, three, two, one. And we are doing that bent over row and reverse fly. Hinge at the hips and row, fly. Good, squeezing those back muscles. That's all I want you to think about, squeezing those back muscles. Fantastic work. Starting to burn. Yeah. Good. We are gonna move into abs next. Three, two, one. Weights down and we're doing flutters on the ground. Hands underneath our bottoms, legs out and we are doing flutters. Now my head is off the ground. I'm pressing my lower back into the floor and I'm moving my legs up and down. The higher you bring your legs, the easier it is. The lower your legs are to the floor, the harder it becomes. We're gonna roll over into an X plank. In five, four, three, two, one, and we're rolling over in push-up position, and then we're gonna to touch our opposite hand to foot. Good. Now, while I'm doing this, I realize that the last exercise is skipping and I don't have a skipping rope, so I'm gonna to have to try and find that in a second. And turning over into flutters. Go, 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 go. Now, again, I did realize that I need a skipping rope at this point, so I need to find that. But also, if you don't have a skipping rope, you can do jumping jacks on the spot. Let's go, push it out. Go, 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 you got five seconds, four, three, two, one, X plank, turning over. Now this is where I realize, hmm, where am I getting the skipping rope from? And then I might, I think there was just one on the floor, so I was like, right, I've got this. And then I'm back, real focus on my exercise. Go, go, go. Don't stop, you got five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Now where? Is that skipping rope? Perfect. And we are going into one minute of skipping and my skipping rope had a knot in it, but you know what? I just pushed through, I pretended it was fine. And it was fine, look at me go. So we are here for one minute. I'm just gonna change it up and do sort of different types of skipping. You can do whatever you want. I just don't want you to stop. So if you don't have a skipping rope, you can do jumping jacks. But let's just go non-stop. Some butt kicks, something to distract you. This is express, full body. Go, 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 keep going. Whatever cardio move you choose, don't stop. Let's go. Last 10 seconds, we're gonna go as hard as we can. Nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and I am spent. That, oh, that was hard. Well done, everyone. Amazing work. I'll see you next time.